I have been ally of Mr. Disjain over the past quarter century. We met uh, each other in, at PMI conferences in the, in the United States in the early part of 1990. I'm very pleased to be back here, the World Project Management Forum with ADESH. Of course, I'm one of the 30 signatories of uh, World Project Management Forum. Actually, Adesh and I have been struggling to promote not only just delivery-based project management, but always we are proposing to have strong total cycle project management, including front-end development. But actually, with the advent of soft project and the light weight project management, mainly in IT and other management services, this very important, the first chain of the project cycle, that's front-end project development, is uh, sort of missing nowadays. So I'm very pleased to join forces with Adesh and uh, speakers invited for this forum to once again have a look at the total cycle project management, including front end project development. And actually, many of the project, I would say half to 60% of, of the project, are reported to fail. Why? Very ill defined uh, definition of a project. That means uh, ill defined or lack of value that specific project or program have to achieve, right? In this sense, uh, I think great, this uh, uh, World Project Management Forum is a great vehicle to integrate uh, not only the traditional delivery-based project management, but more strategic uh, front-end, mid-implementation, uh, and even delivery, after delivery service uh, of uh, project uh, products. Now, I have uh, listened to very interesting presentation by my colleague speakers. They addressed uh, project management 3.0, uh, business analysis in the front end phase by practice by major uh, program project management company based in Europe. And also I proposed uh, typical models of uh, project uh, program ma management in the front end planning stage. That means how to maximize uh, value. In other words, they say benefits, but I prefer value. That is a term that my Japanese standard P2M refers to, right? And so uh, really I have realized my uh, instant initiative of coming here and joining forces my uh, uh, colleagues in looking at once again total cycle program management and project management. Now, what will be next? We have gathered very intelligent strategic presentation, yet we still have to wait a uh, more clear-cut definition of uh, project, or in other words, value benefit realization. So during the one year time, uh, before the next worldwide World Project Management Forum, uh, slated for December next year, we will work uh, fully by means of task forces, etc., uh, to uh, come out with uh, more concrete methodology about front-end project development. This can be both for uh, industrial project, private project, private sector project, as well as public project. We have many things to do. Uh, still, uh, well, uh, fortunately, we have listened to 
uh, what the issues are and uh, how we feel that uh, we respond to these issues. But we have not just seen very clear cut routes to uh, claim that we are missing uh, more efforts about uh, front end project uh, development. I uh, come from the Japan stop and was five largest. Uh, the practice we, we have uh, at my former employer uh, is too deep, right? So it's not quite easy to transplant uh, what we have uh, to other sectors, as an industry uh, branch. But uh, I think this is a collection. I mean, the World Project Management Forum is a collection of uh, intellectual and very strategic uh, players project problem management. So we will find a way uh, that uh, what I have found and uh, we are looking forward to uh, see uh, in one year from now here in New Delhi. Thank you very much. People get energized during we meet here once a year, but in between you have to have the, the say, robust uh, task forces to uh, realize what we are going to agree after this during the conclusion session. And so, I mean, the WPM forum, World Project Management Forum, must have a task force, standing task force, to uh, address more in detail the, the solution, I mean, the suggestion that we have picked up uh, during the today. Uh, forum. And also, I think there are more, I think more players, speakers that can come out with more concrete idea about the mission of World Project Money Forum. So we can't repeat uh, the, say, uh, uh, dissolution of the previous worldwide vehicle. We had actually, but that's ended up with some, uh, what I say, uh, uh, lack of uh, the mission attainment. So that's, that's my concern as well as this time we should not fail. We have done uh, exceptionally good because I have traveled, I attended so far about 45 to 50 world uh, congresses of PMI, IPMA. Well, they were great before, but nowadays, a little bit, the sort of world congress is just collection of uh, speakers, right? And uh, really uh, traditional things seems as well as uh, themes such as uh, project, uh, agile project management, right, or business agility. It is okay for some sort of project, but here in India, we are still honoring traditional, very robust capital investment project, infrastructure project, that's a mainstay of a gasoline, right? So uh, in that sense, and coming from the traditional project man management sector, I'm very much happy, satisfied with the result of this uh, conference. It's, it's not easy for me, a pretty old person, to come and spend the two days presenting uh, twice and having one more private sector to, uh, session tomorrow morning, but really uh, it's, uh, this conference is rewarding to me personally. And I think this to all of the participants. Uh, first, uh, my suggestion, do not depend on standards. Standards, uh, the project management associations killing standards claim that our standards are de facto, or the global. But the first thing you should do is do project management by thinking your own way. Right? Standards are just to support about efficiency of how to uh, quickly, efficiently pick up standard knowledge. 
But what is very needed for young project managers now is do practice, right? Your way. But you can depend somehow on published standards, right? And that way you can uh, really acquire real competence or competency. Right? That's my suggestion. Because there are so many certified project managers who don't know how to, to get things done, really, or how to deliver the project management. Always seek uh, advice from somebody. That's not what I want to see.